What is up and welcome back to today's video. This one is long overdue. I have been meaning to do a try on clothing haul for so long and I just haven't done one. So I went a little bit crazy as you will see. Um, there's like $600 worth of clothes just chilling here. Um, but this stuff is really cute and I think that you guys will love it. Before we hop into the video, I do have two announcements. One, I am going to be in Los Angeles for two weeks. I will be in Los Angeles from the 5th to the 16th. So if you notice that my videos are a little bit weird or I'm only posting like once a week or something, um, that's why. So pay attention to my Instagram. Um, I will be at VidCon, so if you guys live in Los Angeles or if you're going to VidCon and you wanna meet up, like let me know. Um, I don't really know how VidCon really works. So pay attention to my Instagram story. Maybe I will find a location on a certain day and I'll put it on my Instagram story and be like, hey, if anyone you know wants to meet up here, let me know on this day at this time. I would love to meet you guys. I've only actually met two fans before in real life and they're both when I'm like not looking cute. I have like my glasses on, no makeup on. I just got off work. Um, so it'd be kind of cool to actually like take photos with you guys um, and you know, look presentable for one. Also, I have Snapchat, so I don't use it super, super often, but um, especially during VidCon, you want to be following me on my Snapchat. I will be snapping so much, letting you guys know where I am at all times. Okay, and the last announcement that I have before we hop into this video is I was nominated, and I'm really excited for it, um, to be Pittsburgh's best YouTuber of 2019. So I'm going to have that link down in the description. All you have to do is like click it and then like fill out, I think it's literally like your email and your name and then boom, that's it. It takes like 20 seconds, um, but voting ends, I believe on July 5th. So if you guys want to go ahead and vote for me, that would be super cool. Um, but I'm really excited if I do win because you get a plaque, you get to go to this big like party and there's gonna be a DJ and I'll vlog the whole thing um, if I do win. But go ahead um, if you want to go vote for me there, that would be super cool. And hit the subscribe button if you have not hit the subscribe button. We are on track to hit 100,000 subscribers by the end of June. It'll suck if you are watching this in July and I'm still not at 100,000, but but according to my social blade, I don't know. Um, we're supposed to hit 100,000 by the end of June, so fingers crossed. All right, so now onto the try on portion. I promise you I'm done talking. Um, very first piece I am so obsessed with. It is this super pretty striped romper here. I am obsessed. The one thing I will warn you guys about, it is very cheeky. Um, so if you guys are into that, that's super cool. If you're not, um, you can actually lower the straps a little bit so it's a little bit less cheeky, you know, just so you know. Uh, but the material is great. It's not see-through at all. Also, if you guys want to shop any of the looks, I will have everything linked down below along with a coupon code. If you just use Courtney XO, you will get 20% off. I paired it up with these sunglasses and I am so living for this. I needed a good pair of sunglasses for Los Angeles and I finally found one. The next outfit I'm actually wearing, so it is this pink, it's kind of like a pink and a beige. Like you'll notice I sort of had a theme going. It's like blush, beige, and tan. Like I didn't plan it to be that way. Oh, and pink. So I didn't really plan it to be that way, but it just sort of happened. And I like that it's just like, it's a crop top, but it's also just like free and loose. And then I paired it up with these super like loose fit mom shorts. And I love them because they're really comfortable. These ones are very flattering. They're also a really good length too. The next is this dress right here. So I got a two in this and I definitely should have gotten a four. It still fits fine as you can see, um, but I would definitely prefer it to be a little bit looser, but to make it kind of like, you know, being extra, being me, I paired it up with this like mini, like, what is this called? Like a white baby tee. It's also like super in style right now. Still using the white baby tee. I got these pants and guys, these may be my favorite pair of pants I've ever gotten. So they are so comfortable. Once again, I got a four in these um, and they do have pockets. So that's an extra bonus. They're just so comfortable and so free because these are just so like light and airy. You can wear them anytime. Okay, this next, <laughs> this next outfit, you are either going to love me for it or you are going to totally hate me for it. Uh, but there's a story behind it. So I was in Los Angeles probably I wanna say either two years ago or like two and a half years. 
It was probably one of my favorite times being in Los Angeles and I got to go to this like Hollywood magazine party and I got to meet like David Dobrik and Josh Peck and Corinna was there um, and so that night we exchanged numbers and the next day we went shopping and I remember we were at Topshop. It was the first time I'd ever been to a Topshop and I remember walking around and I was like seeing all the prices and I was like oh my gosh this is so expensive but I tried on a skirt that looked just like this and I remember looking at it and being like why can't I pull that off and Corinna pointed to it and she was like I bet you you can like I think like she was like try it on I bet you'd be surprised and so I tried it on and I actually fell in love with it here's a picture of it right here I fell in love with this also the price tag was like 70 or 80 dollars so I was like no um, I'm not gonna buy it but it was fun trying you on so now when I go to Los Angeles I have a skirt that resembles basically what I you know found with Corinna and I loved and so maybe maybe it was two years late but I'm still obsessed with it and to pair it up I actually got this pink bodysuit okay this is so stylish and it's so I don't know I feel like neon is so trendy right now and I like the material of this one too because I have a loving hate relationship with bodysuits because sometimes like you can't wear a bra with a bodysuit like nine times out of ten but this one's a really nice thick material I don't even have to wear a bra which is super nice and then I paired it up with these sunglasses that are so trendy I've been looking for a pair of these for so long and I have not found them until now I got these white shorts here I like shorts like this <laughs> because they're high-waisted um, they're stretchy you know they don't you know show all of your curves they're very flattering I love them and they have pockets always a plus I did something different with this outfit so the black bandeau that you see is actually a swimsuit um, but I use this as a bandeau and then I use this dad dress shirt I love oversized things and so I tucked it in on one side to make it look just like very loungy very like I didn't care at all I put zero effort into my outfit even though there was definitely effort there speaking of the swimsuit okay so as I mentioned before this is the top and these are the bottoms I love the material of the bottoms they hold you in there they are cheeky so if that's your style definitely recommend now with the swimsuit top I still think it's super cute um, I do want to give you guys a little bit of a heads up so it doesn't like it's not I don't know how to describe this hold on I need to <laughs> talk to my roommate about how to describe this <laughs> okay <laughs> um, I called for some backup basically she said to tell you guys <laughs> that it's just like it's a thin material and so when you're wearing it it can roll up or it can roll down so it can actually like roll itself inside out did I do a good job explaining that okay cool then I got this piece here and you guys are going to live for this I'm living for it um, so it is just this white sheer long sleeve I will say I thought there was a white bandeau underneath it but it doesn't matter because I could just put that black swimsuit or I also have other bandeaus I have a white bandeau I have like a black bandeau I have patterned bandeaus so just putting some sort of bandeau underneath this um, and it has these Oh, these little gems and rhinestones all over it. I'm down to only two items left in this try on haul. So the first one is this bikini set. So it is white and it has this knot here. Um, I'm very impressed by the material actually. I always get nervous with white, you know what I mean? Like white sometimes can just be very, you know, transparent, very see-through. Um, but surprisingly, this is not. It's great, great material. And the last piece, is one of my favorites I love it um, so it is this romper so it does tie in the front and then it does have this cute little you know opening here it's just it's very free it's very sp free spirit I love the color I love the material um, it's just very girly loungy uh, but you, it looks like you tried you know what I mean? Okay guys, and that was it for my try on haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to go ahead, give it a big thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. And once again, if you guys wanna shop any of my looks, I will have everything linked down below along with a coupon code. If you use CourtneyXO, you will get 20% off your next purchase. And with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here and I will see you guys later. Bye.